very much. New at 10, a wrong way disaster. A drunk driver causes chaos on the Hone Bridge, smashing head on into another driver. People were dodging this guy left and right. But one unlucky driver could not get out of the way in time, and it was all captured on video. Steve Shamraz is live with that amazing video and the end result. Steve. Mike and Carol driving across the Hone Bridge can be scary enough when the weather was as bad as it was last night, but it was especially frightening around 845 last night as one of the drivers going across that bridge was driving the wrong way. It was five minutes of terror as drivers on the Hone Bridge had to dodge a car coming right at them. At first glance, it's hard to notice anything wrong with this picture, but look again. The car on the top of your screen shouldn't be showing us headlights, but taillights. It's even easier and more terrifying to see here. The driver passing other cars on 794 in the wrong direction. And according to the sheriff, this man was so drunk and so confused, he drove up onto the freeway going the wrong way. We'd love to tell you exactly where this happened, but again, the sheriff tells us this man was so drunk, he doesn't remember where he drove onto the freeway. The man at the wheel, 64-year-old Robert Kieser, his first arrest for drunk driving and the county's first wrong way drunk driving arrest of the year. This wrong way trip ended quickly as he slammed into another car head on. Amazingly, Kieser wasn't hurt and the other driver only had a broken arm. Their cars took the worst of it though, mangled wrecks after the collision, making the fact no one was seriously hurt all the more remarkable. And Milwaukee County continuing its track record in 2013 of wrong way drivers. This was the second one of the year, though only the first one where alcohol may have been a factor in the bad decisions of a driver. On your side, live in Milwaukee tonight, Steve Shamras, today's TMJ4. Yeah, thank goodness that other injured driver was not killed. Thanks, Steve.